Assalamu alaikum everybody what's up welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel welcome to another episode of pakistan to germany so in this episode i'm going to discuss about all the documents that you guys needed to know to process your visa application file and uh, this is like the most crucial step of whole process and you cannot get wrong here like this is the end this is the most important video just do watch it completely and understand all the things that I'm telling you. Whatever the documents I'm going to tell you, be mindful that you are going to make your visa file according to like the sequence I'm going to share with you guys. But before that, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, please do me a favor and push that subscribe button. And if this video helps you in any way, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions or suggestions, the comment box is always open for you guys. And yes, do follow me on Instagram. The handle is somewhere over here. So now let's get to the most important part of the video, which is preparing your visa application file. So the first and foremost thing is your visa application form. You can download it from German Embassy's website. I'm going to link it down below. You have to download the latest version, mostly latest version here, which have a basic website pay uploaded over that. So you just have to take the print of it and you have to like fill it out. Or you can just fill it out and then take the print of it and then just sign it. The second most important thing is your biometric pictures. You have to take almost four to five pictures and they should be of white background and they should be biometric pictures. That's where I messed up. Many pictures are biometric and I didn't know that there is like a higher difference, but uh, it went well. They did it themselves, uh, but you should take the biometric pictures with you, at least five pictures and both a white background and blue background is not accepted. Uh, and don't glue or staple your pictures on the form just keep them separate you use the paper clips for to like pin them with the paper but don't use the staple or glue or anything like that the next thing is your admission letter that you have received from your university if you have the enrollment letter too you can also uh, put that in but if you don't have the enrollment letter yet, after you have enrollment then don't worry, admission letter just works fine. But if you have the enrollment letter, uh, do add it. Don't forget to add it, right? The next thing that you're going to add is your blog account confirmation, like uh, the confirmation that you're going to receive from your blog account company that they have received 1,208 euros in your account. But if you haven't received that confirmation yet, all you have to do is to attach the proof of the transaction that you have transferred the money from your end. So that works completely fine. They are going to give you the time to submit the blog account confirmation and they give you enough time to submit that. You have to mail mail they take uh, email document with the reference number that they are going to give you email and then it works the next thing is your cv and your letter of motivation a uh, letter of motivation is only for the crash consulate german embassy will be letter of motivation attached karne, but wo aapko likhna bhi padega. so you can attach it likhna padega, to aap uh, next thing is your university degrees photocopies uh, this photocopy must be attested from hec i have already mentioned that in my documents video if you haven't watched it yet go and watch it that is like the informative video then you have to add your intermediate uh, mat intermediate and metrics mark sheet and degrees and give you your ibcc se attested copies jo hain, wo attach honge. and also do remember that you have to take all original documents with you you don't have to submit your original documents but you have to take them with you right they can ask for them and um aapke jo copies hain, wo attested on this point pe, ibcc se, that is like the mandatory thing to do attested nahi honge, not acceptable Next thing is internship letter. If you have any, if you don't have any, just skip this document. The next one is your job letter. Again, if you have it, if it applies to you, then add it. If not, then you can simply skip it. Uh, the next is, this is important, your language certificate, IELTS, TOEFL, Joby you have given language certificate. If you have university requirement for the university and you have not given the IELTS, then do remember that your visa is a requirement. Hai. So, you have to give IELTS. Dena ka. Next is the salary slip of the sponsor. Joby bhi bandha aapko aapke blog account ke sponsor kar raha hai, like your father, your brother, or even if you yourself was doing some job, then you have to add your salary slip. So whosoever is the sponsor, you have to add their salary slip. And yeah, this is only for the Islamabad Embassy Karachi Consulate. Wano ko ye karne ki zhurat nahi hai. Uh, next one is the sponsor's bank statement uh, of at least six months or wo bhi aap logo ko 
सिर्फ इस्लामाबाद एम्बेसी वालों को चाहिए कराची कौंसलेट वालों को नहीं चाहिए सो लास्ट सिक्स मंथ्स की आपने बैंक स्टेटमेंट जो अवॉइड करनी है अपने स्पॉन्सर की एंड डो रिमेंबर दैट दिस बैंक स्टेटमेंट शुड बी गुड इनफ लाइक देर शुड बी द बैलेंस ऑफ द इनफ्लॉक्स एंड आउटफ्लॉक्स ऑफ द मनी लाइक एकदम से ही एट द एंड पे कहीं से पैसा नहीं आ रहा हो जस्ट टू शो इट टू द एम्बेसी देर इट शुड बी बैलेंसड बैंक स्टेटमेंट नेक्स्ट वन इज एफिडेविट of support sponsors affidavit of support ya aapne apna ek affidavit banana like stamp paper banana i think it is of 1000 or something aur usme ye likha hoga basically that um the the particular person like the sponsor is all is going to sponsor that particular student for the one year in germany and all that okay to uska aapko affidavit tayar karna hota hai then you have to attach that affidavit then you have to add the sponsor's identity card photocopy uh, or their passport photocopy ya unke identity card ki ya cnic ki photocopy wo aapko add karni hai and do remember these photocopies should be of a4 size theek hai a4 size hi chalta hai sirf embassy mein aur kisi size mein nahi wo mini mini id card ki jo hum copies karate hain wo nahi chalenge right so next thing is very important uh, pehle it was not compulsory but now it is compulsory frc family रिलेशन सर्टिफिकेट डैट यू आर गंग टू गेट फ्रॉम नादरा आप जाके नादरा से ले सकते हो यू कैन गेट इट लाइक बाई अपलाइन ऑनलाइन ओके नेक्स्ट वन इज योर ओन पासपोर्ट्स फोटो कॉपी अगेन ए फोर साइज अगेन ए फोर साइज एंड यू नीड टू गेट द कॉपीज अप टू द साइन पेज साइन पेज तक की कॉपीज आपने जब वो करवानी है एंड या डोंट फॉर गेट योर रिजनल पासपोर्ट विद यू लाइक दैट इज द मेजर स्टेप also uh, next is your health insurance documents that you are going to get with your blog account most probably aapko wo email pe aa jayenge you just have to take the print of them and add them uh, in your visa application file the next is your travel insurance documents exactly same thing aapke wo bhi email pe aapko blog account wale send kar denge if you are taking that package if not or you are taking some private insurance then you can add it you can like take that with you as well The next one is your application declaration form that is also available on German embassy's website. Is me se baap ko sign karna hota hai, date likhni hoti hai. It's you can read it. Declaration hai ye. Then next one is section fifty three and fifty four form of the visa application form. Is me bhi aapko you have to like sign it and add it at this point in your visa application file. Nothing fancier. Just sign it, write your date. The next one is only for Karachi consulate. This is the information sheet, and you can download it from the embassy's website. Last but not the least, you have to take the print out of the appointment confirmation email that you are going to receive from the embassy. Just keep a date likhi hogi ke is date ko apki appointment hai. Wo apne last me lekar jani hai. Uske baghair apko wo shuttle se enter nahi hone dete. And other than that, you have to take the visa fees, which is around, which is seventy five euros. और फिर पासपोर्ट की फीस और शटल की फीस इन सब के पैसे आपने लेकर जाने हैं एंड डू लाइक टेक चेंज विद यू लाइक डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ नोट्स आपके पास होने चाहिए ठीक है बिकॉज दे डोंट हैव चेंज सो इट्स गुड दैट वे एंड अपने साथ आपने पेन भी लेकर जाने वैसे वो आपको देते हैं बट स्टिल इट्स गुड टू टेक अ पेन विथ यू अदर देन दैट येस देर आर सम एडिशनल डॉक्यूमेंट्स दैट यू कैन एड टू योर फाइल टू फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ यू हैव एनी बिजनेस और इफ यू हैव एनी रेंटल प्रॉपर्टीज और um if you have any rental agreements or any other properties if they question you that you don't have enough expenses or aapke bank statement achhi nahi hai ya aapka salary slip kam hai ya kuch is tarah ka to you can always show that property to them see we have this much money to cover my expenses and we can afford it so ye aapne documents apne file mein add nahi karne but separately aap apne saath lekar ja sakte ho and if you are submitting it to the embassy then they need it to be notarized from kachari or notary public other than that the important thing is that you have to make the two sets of like ye main aapko jitne documents bataye this is one set and you have to make two such sets and all the photocopies should be a4 size and uh, and don't forget your original documents they can ask you at any point for your original documents and aapke original documents bhi us point pe attested hone chahiye as i mentioned in my documents video kahan uh, kahan se aapne kaun kaun se documents kab kab jo hai attest karwane hain so this is pretty much it about the visa application file hopefully this video was helpful for you and all i wanted you is to subscribe to this channel like share and subscribe comment and keep sharing and keep supporting and keep spreading love thank you for watching allah hafiz stay tuned